food? What is food? I swear to God, this is interesting. Just hear me out on this. Before we start, who cares? Me. I do. I care. A lot. Also, I don't make YouTube videos. This isn't like my thing. So if it looks awful, just be aware that this was made in iMovie and Google Slides. Now, I've been working on the strategy guide for this on Strategy Wiki, and I'm trying to make it the most complete thing there is. But then this guy came up, Bomberto. He's that guy right there. Bomberto wants some food, and I wanted to write that down in the strategy guide. But then I realized I don't know what counts as food. So I went to a reliable website to find out more, and they did not cover it. In fact, it wasn't really helpful at all. So what do I do? We determine what food is myself. Now you might be thinking, doesn't any consumable item count as food? And to which I say, no, not really. For example, power punch, curd shells, and tasty tonics. Those are consumable items, but they are not food. Not one of them is considered edible food by Bomberto. In fact, the volt shroom, which is a mushroom, is also not food. Being a mushroom does not change that fact. But you know what is food? Hot sauce. Yes, the liquid condiment is considered food, and hot sauce is actually a very important item because it specifies a couple of different things. It doesn't matter if you have to consume the item inside or outside of battle. HP and FP are not the only metrics for being food. If it's a drink, if it's a condiment, you don't care. It's food. And it doesn't have to be cooked through zesty to count as food. There are also some items that don't restore HP and FP, but are still considered food. For example, love pudding and peach tart give you random status effects in battle. They still count as food. We'll start off easy. These are items that are discernibly not food. Most of them make sense. I wouldn't want to eat a gold bar or a bolt of lightning or a shard of ice. But there is one other item that belongs on this list of not being food. The wack -a bump Yes, really. wack -a bumps are not considered food, even though they restore HP and FP. They're pretty hard to come by. My guess is this is a Chapter 1 trouble and this is a Chapter 5 item, so maybe it was an oversight. But I don't think it was an oversight, because they did pay attention with the hottest dog in the Nintendo Switch version. The hottest dog is food. Instead of trying to find all the things that aren't food, let's try and find some things that are food. To start, Bomberto has a really strong stomach. Poison mushrooms and trial stew, he'll chow down just fine. He doesn't have a problem with eating them at all. There's no special dialogue or anything either, which I think is kind of lame. It also doesn't need to taste good. Several of the items that he will eat are explicitly listed as not tasting very good, such as dried shrooms, inky sauce, and coconuts. Oh, and also drinks count as food. Yeah, I want some tea for lunch. Oh, and also leaves, for some reason. Food is leaf. It's kind of weird. But my ultimate favorite, while well, trying to figure out what food is, is uh, food is bomb, actually. So the coconut bomb, egg bomb, courage meal, and zest dynamite, these are all considered foods. Bomberto will eat them. Mario can't, but Bomberto will. My guess is it's because they are zesty cooked items. And that's why they're allowed, but it's such a weird thing to allow him to do. Anyway, without beating around the bush anymore, here's all the food. If it's one of these items Bomberto will eat, they are all considered food. This is the formal list. I would assume that they also work with Eve in Chapter 4, but I didn't feel like trying to test it twice. Now let's talk about optimizing your returns for this trouble because 11 coins is really going to do it for you. Dried shrooms cost two coins at Westside Goods, and you get a couple freebies in Chapter 6 if you really want to put it off. Tasty Tonic, 
All you got to do is cook it to make a mistake and hand it over to him. You can basically get free mushrooms from the Happy Lucky Lottery. Yeah, there's the entry fee of 10 coins, but if you just sell a couple of them, it kind of pays itself off anyway. You can get a turtley leaf in Chapter 1, or even do Mayor Group's Trouble and get that one. Boom, it's free, you don't have to worry about it. If you're trying to complete every recipe, you'll have a trial stew. You probably don't want to eat it. It's only worth one coin at shops. You could give him that and get it out of your hands. The horrors persist, and so do I. Thank you for watching this insane little ramble.